Hello friends, this is your amigo, compadre, cuate, carnal, Jose Arroz, also known as the Mexican Bob Ross. Today we're going to be drawing the basics of art. So a lot of my fans have been telling me I don't know how to draw or even do a painting but that is okay today we're gonna be learning that it's very very simple anybody can do it in fact we're gonna start with so basic do you think man I should have done in pro level by now I'll teach you how to do it but first this is your utensils and then this little guy right here so you can put the mixture of the painting the what I'm going to use today so is this is from Art Studio. I'm going to be using this, it's a blue color. And of course, I'll be using this guy right here, which is a canvas. So we're going to use that to do our painting. So, we're going to do the basics. Now, what is the basics we're going to do? Well, we're first going to open this little guy right here. Squirt a little bit of oil on it. Acrylic oil. Just like that. Just a little bit, not too much, nothing too crazy. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use my brush and just use a little bit of it right here, just like that. Have a little bit of that happy little, little azul, blue color. And the first basis we're going to do is going to be a stick figure. Yes, friends, some people can't even draw a stick figure. So we're going to do that first. So very, very, very basic. We're going to start here as if we're going to draw the letter Y. Start right here, we go like this, just like that, one stroke like that, then the other one right here, like that, make it a little bit darker here, that's the first part of it, like a V, you can even make it the letter V, just like that friends. The next thing I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna go down right here, and make the Y go down like that. See? Nothing too complicated, friends. Just like that. A, a V right there, and then a little line makes it into a Y. That is the first part to draw, to draw the basics, to paint the basics in art. Now, to make it even more incredible, I'm going to flip this. Oh my goodness, can you see the little stick figure, man? We're almost there. Now, to make it even better, make sense out of it we're gonna do a little cross like right about here not right there not right there not right here but right there in the middle I can even put a little thing right there to remind me where it's gonna be at and we're gonna do this right here just like that you can almost see the little guys waving at us Okay, the next thing I'm going to do is the circle. Now, the circle is very important, friends, because if you make the circle wrong, it might look weird. So make, make it as possible, as round as possible. So we're going to use a little more of the color, and we're going to do the little circle right here. There we go. Okay, friends, like I said, really simple stuff here. Really simple, nothing too complicated. A little more darker right here for my little circle. And then we're gonna go right there. And then same thing with this other side. Make the circle go this way. There you go, friends. Make this lens a little bit darker because they were a little bit lighter. The same thing with this one. And there you go friends, the basics of art, a stick figure, an oil, an acrylic painting, excuse me. So now, because he needs personality, we're going to do a little bit more of detail here. For this one, we'll add two little dots, one right there, and one right there. And then he needs a face, he needs also that mouth. We're going to make him a happy little mouth. Happy little, contento little mouth right here. And there you go, friends. Let's add a little bit of shadow to make him look a little more real. Put a brush stick sweet going all the way here. And 
There you go, friends. You have a stick figure. Let me show you the little detail of the masterpiece right here. Little stick figure. But this is just one style of doing stick figures. Let's look at different other styles we can do of drawing a stick figure, man. For example, amigos, style you could do a stick figure in art is called cubism. It started in the early 20th century. So realism, modern art, the style of abstract art. Another really cool one is the style of Renaissance, like Leonardo da Vinci style, Renaissance style. Another one that's really popular <laughs> is pop art. You have another style called minimalism. The other is continuous art, which is doing a drawing with only one line. You have your classic Japanese style, ukiyo-e, traditional Japanese style, or you can do realism. And for two of my fans who are watching this, Kohen and Atticus, as you can see, there are many different styles of artwork. All you have to do is try them out and keep practicando or practicing. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And next time we're gonna be interviewing Leonardo da Vinci. So stay tuned friends for the next video. Adios amigos. I was lost, but I wasn't alone. Devoe.